Hi, welcome. We are creating a new package here. And uh, if you update your system, well, today I would say, but uh, at this point in time, it's still in testing, but today is the 9th of June. We've changed um, the way we use the update mirrors. So when you update today, you, had, you have this update of Arclux system configuration. And if you say yes, there is some text. So we removed here some update mirror servers, which is good. And update mirror servers moved to its own package. Why is that? There was a user on uh, the forum. So please give us ways to improve our system. We don't want any frustration. And he was frustrated and says, look, um, this service that we're running normally uses, uh, it's, it's used for convenience sake. You boot up and you get the latest and newest Arch Linux servers around, right? So it's a no fuss thing and it, it runs in the background and it works. Now for him, it's a bother because the, the service he's getting, where he is living, the world is a big place, where, here, where he is living, he gets the wrong service. So the, the reflector, the package that is going to, um, well, ch check out what is the fastest Arch Linux service around, is not doing a proper job in his case, okay? So I thought, let's get rid of this package um, of the updating service. Well, not get, let's update this package, Arch Linux system config kit, and move the service out of there. And it says here, the update mirror services move to its own package. So now it's either a choice if you want this service or not. So I hope uh, I have helped this user and so many users with him that if you want a service, you have actually to do something, right? So I'm going to go for sudo pacma minus s, Linux system d services now if it's a clean install it will be there right but it, this is not a clean install so we keep rolling and we've given again some explanations the update mirror service moved from arclinux system config git to this package and as you see indeed we have a new service here the small difference so just for us guys this is update mirrors with an s and the new guy is update mirror so we still know um, how to help people if something uh, happens or anything. We ask, hey, what's exactly the exact name? Is it with an S or without S? But basically, well, we're back to square one. Everything is back again the same, but not for this particular user because he can not install this package. If he will not install Arclix, um system D services, well, there is no service running and he will keep his end mirror list because that's what we're talking about. This is the list of all the services, servers that um, this application reflector found for Belgium. This one is the fastest and everything is coming from this one. And if this one fails, then it's gonna take the second one and the third and so on. But if it fails, then normally often it's just your internet connection that's gone. All right, so I hope that's clear um, with all the explanations we've put in here. The updating for the, the service that's going to update Arch Linux um, mirrors or servers has moved to a separate package and then you can decide to either install it or uninstall it. All right, have fun.